Hey guys, this is Getsumara, and welcome back to Let's Play Oracle of Ages. In the last episode, we headed out to sea, after talking to the lonely fisherwoman, I guess, since it's not a fisherman, but it could because this is a man's world, and I don't know, I'm just going on and on, I gotta stop making hand gestures, my Italian blood is getting to me, alright, alright, no more hand gestures, anyways, um... When we got here, there's a lot of uh, that sick crap in the water. So we've been having to go port through time a lot just to get there. So let's keep going. We want to use our Hippie Tool of Time, the perfect edition. And keep going. It's kind of like a maze. For now. After we do something, it won't be a maze because we'll be able to fix it. So let's keep going. And did I just get hit by something? Oh, I did. Oh well. So let's go over here. I love the mermaid suit because you can swim pretty fast. So we go surface where we can. I think it's up here. There we go. And we climb up here, if I'm not mistaken. So let's try it. And alright, I forgot to say the hippie tool time thing. My bad, my bad. Oh wait, let me turn off my TV. I'm sorry if that caused a little bit of problem. There you go. Yeah. I'm recording this on a whim because I recorded a bunch of Okami. Some of it I might have to record, because the freaking frame drops are annoying as hell. But yeah, if it happens, it happens. Plus, Okami's really fun, so I don't mind it. I mean, Ages is really fun, too, because... Well, it is, except we're getting to the most heinous part of this game. Oh, crap. That's right, that's right. I gotta go underwater. But yeah, as I was saying, we were getting to the most heinous part of this game. Something so bad and awful that it ma makes... Me uh, mentally repress it in terms of fear to protect my mind from its chaos. That would be Jabu Jabu's belly. Yes, it's that bad. And hey, the Zoras, we're in the Zoras village apparently. Welcome, young mermaid. This is the Zora village. Don't call me a mermaid, call me a merman. I am the Aquaman of Legend of Zelda. Oh yeah, what's over here? I'm gonna talk to the villager just because to see what's going on. What's up, buddy? Isn't there anyone who can entrust the Zora symbol of heroism to? The symbol, the Zora scale, is a powerful sea charm. I'll take it, give it here. Come on! I want the Zora scale. I, I won't use it for misdeeds. I, I totally won't. It's not like I haven't bombed several thousand people in this game already. The Zora scale won't help me do that, possibly. Hmm. I wonder, can we surface? Oh, we can, cool. So we can get that treasure chest, no problem. Yeah, there's a lot of surfacing and going back underwater. Pretty much, uh, for the next few episodes, you're gonna see me only swimming, because that's all you gotta do right now. Which is, alright, it's not that bad, actually. I like the whole swimming aspect, how the water, the water effect is pretty cool, how it's, uh, the little tide on the screen, or whatever. The ripples, that's what they are, ripples. There's a large library east of King Zora's Palace. Cool, good to know, good to know. Not like I want to go read some books anytime soon. Well, actually, there are some, but, like, I don't know. I like reading, but it has to be something I'm interested in. Let's see, what's the sign say? Oh! Did not mean to break the sign. Damn! See? That's how that's how much I don't want to read. Come on, come on. King's Zora's Palace. Alright, let's go to... No, no, don't service. Let's go to King Zora's throne room. Let's see how he's doing. Anybody around here I can talk to? Oh, there's this guy. Cool. This was the palace of our ruler, King Zora, but long ago the king fell ill. Ever since, we've continued on with no king, that which king looked after. The key to Eyeglass Isle Library. It's been lost. Aw, oh, that sucks. What do we got here? Oh, snap, 200 rupees. That's pure bliss. It is ecstasy. Yeah. But oh man, that couldn't have come at a perfect their time because we're pretty low on rupees. And now we can afford another potion when I die, because I'm gonna die in this like dungeon. I'm 100% positive. So I guess let's go see what's up with Jabu Jabu. Maybe if he uh, looks mighty tasty, cook him up real nice. You know, put some uh, butter, some garlic, that kind of stuff on him. Treat him like salmon. Jabu Jabu resides beyond here. It's said to be quite amazed inside his belly. 
Oh yeah, I totally remember that. Freaking refreshing because how bad it is then. What's up? Hey. Let me in. Let me in. Come on. Fine. I don't want to be your friend anyways. <laughs> Why does everybody push me away? And I hate those little gel thingies. Like, toxic crap. I don't know what they're called, but it's toxic crap. Like right here, you can get bounced around like a freaking pinball. I think I've... I think I've you had to use a potion there before because I got bounced around to the point where I died. So let's surface. And, oh, cool. Um, ah! I'd, I'd have totally not just hit that as it came up. What the hell? So let's go in the library. Hey, hey, don't deny us the ability to learn. Only our minds are allowed to do that. And our conscience, they say, don't learn. Don't do it, it's a trap. But I guess since there's nothing left to do in the present, let's go to the past. So let's do the time warp again with the perfect tape tool of time. Yeah! That's kind of pro skittle since we can travel the time whenever we want as long as we're on land. And oh my god, grass. Of course it gives me a heart, because I needed one. And go, go, switch hook. Bam. So let's go in here and... <gasps> it's an Octorok! Well, well, well. I knew we'd meet again. Let's talk to him. Please listen, young one. You may not believe this, but I am the Queen Fairy, guardian of the sea. The curse of an evil one named Varan has made me appear so. The magic of fairy powder can turn me back to normal. Varan has poisoned the sea. Soon all living things in it will perish. Please go find some fairy powder. Well, you know what? I don't believe you. Yeah, because you're an Octorok. Nobody likes you. Nobody believes you. You're going to die now. Bam. Well... We're taking care of another one on our hit list, so let's keep going. Oh yeah, we just jump into the water. But man, this is a Queen Octorok. I can't believe that. Where's the king? Jeez, with how many Octoroks are in games, the queen of must have done the nasty many, many, many times. Like, come on. Producing that many little Octoroks? Well, I could go into it, but I don't know if I want to. Because I might mortify and shock some of the people with, like, Zelda bestiality, which is... It would be very awkward, actually. That stairway leads to the throne room. The king is ill. If you see, if you see him, make, make it brief. Hey, hey, you're not the boss of me. I'll talk to him for hours. I'll be like the old man, he can be the young child who has to listen to me. Our ruler, King Zora, suddenly fell ill. We've done all we can. His condition does not change. If King Zora is dying, how come they're not? Because all sea life apparently is supposed to be dying, but... These Zoras are so cool and blue that they don't have to worry about it. King Zora has no successor. If his illness continues and he passes on, we Zoras will lose our last king. Aw, oh, that's sad. Look at that, the Queen Octorok can do the nasty with everyone she wants, but these guys can't do it with anybody. Like, make him do someone before he dies, just so you have a successor. Like, come on. Put your head into it, man. And here's the last Zora, I think. Soft him. Uh, hey! Ah, this is hard. It's so hard talking to an NPC. But King Zora's face looks so pained, doesn't it? I wouldn't choose those exact words, but I suppose so. We believe we need a special medicine called the Magic Potion to cure King Zora's illness. Where can we find a magician who creates such a potion? Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Do you expect me to give him my Magic Potion that cost me 300 rupees? I for one, I for sir, am not going to do that. You can go suck my cock. Cause look at that. That's a free life, 300 rupee free life. That does not come easy. I am not giving that to you, sir. Good day. Good freaking day. Actually, oh, I forgot something in the present. Anyways, so well, we need to look around the village anyways. Might as well. Plus, I do not want to give it him. I hate him. He can go screw himself. I'm not giving him my magic potion. No, not happening. Not happening. And there's a tree here for a free port. And Gale Seeds, which are very useful because they they don't one-hit the monster. They just make it go away for now. Well, let's use the hippie tool of time and go to the present. Maybe there's a tree here, too. Well, actually, there is. I know for sure there is. Yeah. My mind's only going to repress Jabba Jabba's belly, not the Zora village, because Zoras are cool. So maybe not Princess Buto. In the past, she's a little bitch. Yes, yeah, she is. But, um... Is there anything else we can do here? Hmm... There's a 
bunch of exploring I still need to do, but for now I think we're good, so... Let's go... Hmm. Let's go back to the past then. Yeah, I was just thinking of what needs to be done next. Because, you know, I'm not giving him that magic potion. I'm going to look for another way around. Maybe if I kill him and take the key. You know what? That might work. Let's try it. Because I'm not giving up that magic potion. No, sir. No, sir. Not happening. No, no, no. Great Chloe and the Gogos. I'm not giving up that potion. No. No, 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 no. Not going to give it up. Not going to give up that potion. I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah, yeah. So you want a potion? You want a potion? You're not going to get it. You're not going to get it. Not gonna get it, not gonna get it! Okay, I'm uh, eventually going insane, but we're out of time, so next time on Let's Play Oracle of Ages, we will go kill the Zora King, so see ya then!